folks. I'm loose in the SM. No more face shields. Folks, it is pleasurable to come to the SM again. You feel sort of human. I mean, you got to wear this uh, ear stretcher, this uh, bullshit Fauci mask, but compared to having to wear that fucking grinding helmet, folks, I feel free. It is once again a pleasure to go shopping and I'm hanging out with Flo. We tried to go to BDO, but there were too many people there. Just to look around, one thing I'm kind of pissed off about, and there's a good example, it's okay to bring your dog, but you can't bring your kids. So how is that shit fair? I want to bring my kids. If that woman can bring a dog, why can't I bring my two-year-old and my three-year-old, let them listen to the Christmas music? And believe it or not, you still have people who are voluntarily wearing face shields for what purpose you'd have to ask them because it don't make no sense to me but breaking news folks no more fucking grinding helmets here at the sm in angeles city i'm so damn happy here you go here's another dog and folks i'm a dog lover okay gentleman's got a cute little pug my buddy loves pugs uh i'm not complaining about the fact that you can bring a dog that's not what i'm complaining about I am complaining about the fact that I can't bring my kids up in here. Nope, folks. I just talked to that gentleman. He said 12 years old and above can't come to the SM if I heard him right. But my kids can't come. You can bring dogs, but you can't bring the babies and let them enjoy the Christmas. All right, folks, so there you go. That's the verdict. No face shields, but you gotta be 12 or above. Dogs are okay. What can you do? But you know what? It's just like a total, total different vibe of not having to wear that fucking grinding helmet. Uh, that's too funny. My trike driver's standing by this other trike, right? And I'm telling her, that ain't our trike. But I'm just looking at the number. I wasn't looking at him standing there. And I look up, I'm like, oh, we parked way over here. All right, folks, let me just give you a look. Here you go, SM. Flags up there. Beautiful, hot, sunny day here. All right, we gotta go to BDO to handle some business. Folks, the BDO inside the SM there, they had to have 40 people waiting. I was like, no way in hell. The inside waiting was full. The outside waiting was full. I was like, there's no way in hell I'm going to sit here for two hours. It's not happening. So we're going to try the wonderful friendship. Beard friendship. Over here. In Korea town. Wow, Korean walnut cake. Now that actually sounds delicious right there. I thought about what I wanted to do. I said, you know what? We're right here close to Iguanas. I'm just going to stop in Iguanas and have me a margarita. Maybe take uh, wife number two a snack. Because I'm a good foreign dude like that. Just give you a look at the current state of affairs here. What's known as Koreatown. 
Boom chicken. Boom chicken. I always laugh when I go by that spot. For office space, office space in that building for rent. Over the bridge. If it's open, don't look open, but we'll check it out. Okay, there you go. Closed Mondays. So 11 a.m. to 9 p.m., but closed Mondays. Voila! Voila! Closed on Mondays. But I was really looking forward to drinking a margarita. My goodness. I was trying to do baby was getting his drink the iguanas is closed now it was on the way home you got a beer in the refrigerator i said yeah but said, beer. said cheap ass damn big light i was wanting a proper margarita baby all right, all right we're heading on home because i'm missing the babies missing my babies folks that's what's taking me home Already here on the back way. We're gonna take the back way here past uh, Ollie's Burgers. So we'll just go ahead and head on to the crib. Hope you enjoyed that little quick video. Uh, just one thing, and this is Captain Obvious, I guess. If you, if you live here, you already know this, but if you go to the BDO to SM, there's 40 people in line. If you go to the BDO up there at Friendship in Koreatown, there's only four people in line. I hate to put that out there because I don't want the masses going over there. All y'all keep going to the BDO at the SM <laughs> where I don't have to wait in line behind all you fine folks when I go to the one up there at Friendship. But hey, uh, thanks for being a viewer, a friend here on my channel. So since you are a friend and a viewer, I'll give you that little tip. 
Don't go to the BDO and the SM unless you want to wait behind 40 fucking people. I use that term lovingly. We got a business handle. Flo got her appointment handle. It's all good in the hood. If you're not a subscriber, you know what to do. Right there. Hit that overstay road sign. Get on board my train. Food, beer, visas, bad behavior, barbecue. Beautiful ladies and a carrying on and I don't know what all. <laughs> I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace out.